thought crime Spies are listening Thought crime To what you're typing Thought crime Paranoia stay Be careful what you say How old were they, the, the suspects? Uh, the first one was 32 years old, the second was 18 years old, and the third was 45 years old. And you look at that 18 year old, 18 years on the planet, and he's already finding ways to be a babysitter where they are put in positions to control or oversee individuals. We caught him early enough. Imagine if we didn't catch him until he was 48, how many kids he would have he would assault them during that time. We had a guy show up, and this brings in, up an interesting, you know, ethical debate on all this. I mean, we, what what guy shows up who's too young to be exposed or prosecuted? You know, is is, is that an 18 year old coming for a 14 year old? Is that okay because it's only four years? Is it any less dangerous than a 28 year old coming for a 14 year old? And we had this happen a few weeks ago, where a guy came in who was 18, and he was there for a 13, 14 year old. And I interviewed the law enforcement uh, sheriff in charge of this investigation. And I asked him the very question. I said, does he get a pass because of his age? And the answer is, at least in my opinion, in the opinion of law enforcement, no, because that 18 year old who happened to be a babysitter, who had tons of graphic porn, who was wearing a butt plug when he came in there, wanted to do <laughs> bad stuff to a young kid. I, I'm not making this up. You know, it, this is how it went down. And so if you weigh the danger, you know, he's just as dangerous as a 28, 38, 48, 58, 68, 70 year old guy walking in. So yeah, he makes the movie. Yeah, absolutely. In my opinion, who was wearing a butt plug when he came in there.